Mr. Speaker, all our best laid plans for industrialization will come to naught unless we have a reliable and reasonably priced energy source. You probably say something about the progress we have made, that in discussing the state of our nation, it takes a while even to get into our power supply matters. It gives me great pleasure to be able to say that we have overcome the doomsaw menace. But unfortunately, I cannot say that we have resolved all our energy problems. It is still work in progress. Further, the five years of energy crisis led to the signing of, only, of what can only be described as usurious contracts that have landed our country with a huge, with a huge financial burden. The take or pay contracts resulted in the country being saddled with expensive excess power and are having to pay nearly one billion United States dollars in 2018 and 2019 for power we did not need. We are working to find a way out to ensure reliable power supply at a cost that makes us competitive in the region.